right, all right, all right. What is up, my friends? This is The Feral. We are here. There's my console. Hi, my console. All right, so we are ready to go here. Um, I'm actually using a brand new mic position because my mic stand completely fell over on me <laughs> before I started. So, uh, yeah. But we're going to try this, and we're going to see if this new position works a little bit better for me. I used to have it at the very back of my desk. Now I brought it just a wee bit closer to my... A wee bit, a bit, a bit. All right, let's see here. Let's throw you up there, because I can. Let's throw you over here. All right. Mm. Let's do this. So, yes, I just beat Tales of Brasseria about five minutes ago. And all in all, it was actually a really good game. Well, I'm not actually. Um, I'm a big fan of the Tales series. I have immensely enjoyed every Tales offering that have been on major consoles ever since Tales of Symphonia. I have played every single one. And, uh, yeah, I have thoroughly enjoyed them. I'm about to drop the hammer and dispense some indiscriminate justice. All right, amigo, lurk away. Excuse me. So, yeah, Maldor, I'll definitely, um, I'll let you know when we have more details. I'm going to try and get Dr. Tech to see if he can come. Only issue I don't know if you read is that we will not be able to do it at Knox House. So, um, we'll have to, uh, find a suitable alternative location. A uh, suitable alternative might be Dr. Tech's house. I don't know. I don't know if he'd be down for letting us do those shenanigans. Oh, okay. Not a problem. Do what you need to do, man. Nope, not that. That one. Yay. Roll. <laughs> All right, so last time we left our beefy boy intrepid hero, he was in uh, Aurora's castle and just had a fantastic run-in with uh, Miss Maleficent. All right, so now that we've now that we've set up here, I actually want to uh, pop up my stream on my phone and I want to. All right, beefy boy, let's make this happen. So, stop, hold on, stop, but start, that might be good. Um, all right, so let's get... That's the only one I got. Let's get this one. Beefy boy, let's do this.
so long. Just a little bit. Let's see if that works. Okay. Kes Kemino. Kes Kemino. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. It's my fault her light was stolen. It was because I was weak. No, it's because you're emo. I'm boy. sorry. I'll get your light back. And Once I learn to stand up against the darkness. Hey, let me know if that's better, Kes. Why would Master Xehanort imprison the light? The purest hearts of light. Do they hold the answer? <laughs> All right. Seven pure hearts, each completely void of darkness. Such a search may take some time. Will it, Maleficent? Well, it. Woohoo! Uh, balance of both strength and magic. Still, uh, okay. 
Yeah, I've been having weird issues with my volume lately. I don't know. I've been... It's been a... It's been a struggle. A constant struggle. Alright, we got two new places. Alright, so let us... No. Alright, let's equip that new keyblade. And then shiny. Let's see here. Equip. There you go. Okay. Yeah, because I'm using a little bit of... Uh... Alright. Let's see here. Abilities. So that's just a bunch of fun stuff. Let's see here, reports. Yeah, this is gonna be a lot of blah, blah, blah. Yeah, we'll, I'll blitz through those another time. Oh, uh, let's see here. How, how do I play the game? Ooh, shall I command, blah, blah, blah. All right, okay, we're good. Let's zippity doo -dah. combat level three, and combat level two. Let's do it. Land. Look at this world. Look at this world. Isn't it great? Um. And uh, na 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 na. <laughs> I'm just a beefy boy who's got dashing eyes. Oh. <laughs> Is something wrong? <laughs> you think, beefy boy? It's just that my friends made me the most beautiful dress, but my stepmother and stepsisters right. ruined it. <laughs> I'm used to I shouting so about anyway. I'm so forward to the ball. <laughs> Darkness always finds a way into a wounded heart. Oh, to that strong, is that is flattering. The strength of heart will carry you through the hardest of trials. But I. She's falling her face off, and the first thing you talk about is darkness. Come on, boy. Unversed. Look at my shiny thing. <laughs> this is the most depressing battle music I've ever heard. Holy crap. <laughs> <laughs> Everything is darkness. <laughs> Ain't that the sad story? Freeze! Oh, great. Good job, boy. Thank you for not aiming. I'm blaming it on you. Want some? There you go. Hey, hey. Don't dare do that to me, boy. Little dinker. Drift. Take that. I like the little stars that come out. <laughs> So, um, I have played every game in the Kingdom Hearts series except for this game. And, um... Oh. Uh, 
I have seen this scene so many times that it'd make your head swim. I have uh, two daughters. They are ages tiny and tinier. And Nonsense. good crap. If you'd lost they all your faith, I wouldn't be here. <laughs> and here I am. Oh, come now. Dry um, those tears. Actually, this is um, Birth by like Sleep. Um, Birth the by ball. Sleep was its own game oh, on the I'm PlayStation not. Portable. Of course um, you are. But we'll have to hurry. And now, it um, the storyline of this game takes place oh, yes. um, well before Kingdom Hearts 1, actually. Although, um, the only other game that has been released <laughs> after this game was Dream Drop Distance. So, this is the second to latest game that has come out. Well, unless you count the uh, 2.8, the Aqua, blah, blah, whatever that is. Um, the special Aqua chapter. If you don't count that one, this is actually the second newest game in the series. But, like I said, I, I actually never played this because I never owned a PSP. Um, I am actually playing this on the PlayStation 3 because I already bought these uh, oh, so 1.5 and 2.5 about, like, two months before they said, Oh, hey, we're releasing everything on PlayStation 4. <sighs> Why? I already it's a dropped dream come $30 true. on this, you yes, idiots. I'm not buying it on PS4. I'm afraid this can't last forever. You'll have only till midnight, and then on the stroke of twelve, the spell will be broken, and everything will be as it was before. Yeah, I seriously have seen yes, this I understand. part of this movie probably about a hundred times by now. Booyah! Put it together and what do you got? Bibbidi bobbidi boo yourself, buddy. <laughs> like a PC in the Her heart 80s. was full of light. <sighs> Why didn't I see it? Well, this is on the PSP, and there's actually going to be some really funny scenes that I've seen in, the same um, person. like, Let's Plays and you? Everything Wrong with This Game sure. videos. I'll point them out when Tell I see him. There will be one heart. in this Do part, in this uh, section true? of the game. I, I, I know, I know there is one but in this part. But I also part. believe you have to make an effort to make them come true. Yes, of course. But yeah, I don't but think they believed in something called NPCs in this game. Um, Cinderella yeah. believes well, her I'll leave it at that for now. <laughs> I wanted her to see that she is right. So that's what made her shine. Faith in her heart that anything is possible. Oh, how cute. Where did she go? To the royal ball at the palace. Go, and when you see her dancing, you'll know that she believes, dancing. and that will help you to believe too. Everything good happens when you're dancing. I wish I knew more of that song so I could serenade my wife. All right, let's see here. Any goodies? Any goodies? Not a chest in sight. That sucks. Right, what is this? Where am I going? Oh. Hello. Ah. I guess this is only logical. Cinderella's house is right now. Diamond dust. Oh, that was it. Oh, goody, I get you for it. Take that! Take that! Yeah, your graphics in the GameCube. <laughs> oh. oh, hello, sticker. I 
got a traffic cone. Well, that's not an anachronism. I don't know what is. Let me in! ITM! Let me in! Fine. It's fine. Fine, 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 fine. No, reminder, this is the PlayStation 3. <laughs> Running in an open field, devoid of any landscape, because the developers didn't give a crap about the PSP. <laughs> but, um, yes, I am doing a full Kingdom Hearts run to the lead-up of Kingdom Hearts 3, because it's kind of the popular thing to do. All the cool kids are doing it. And also, I personally haven't played the Kingdom Hearts series... Um, like, I played most of Kingdom Hearts Run just on my own run, um, off-screen. Um, I haven't... I haven't finished it, but I got pretty close to it. Um, I'm actually on the, uh, Hollow Bastion right now, on my offline playthrough, but I think I'm just gonna restart it for the, um, for the stream playthrough. Oh, cool, another one. Yoink. Eat him. Um, so for this playthrough, though, I actually decided that, um, I am going to go through the entire series on the, um, oh, that's on the couch next to the player, so I'll have to go. All right, cool. Not a problem, Kess. Um, I also play Octopath Traveler on the weekends, so if you are a fan of that, you are more than welcome to uh, mash that follow button. And, uh, thank you so much for tuning in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you for the, uh, thank you for the follow, my friend. Um, hold up. Just before you go, um, if you have a few minutes, I would like to do a fantastic yo-yo show for you. Um, it's kind of a thing I do on this stream for new followers. Um, I do, uh, yo-yo shows for follows, subs, donos, big bit drops, raids, all that stuff. So, if you are willing to stick around for a few more minutes, I would love to uh, bust out the wheel of toys and pick a toy to do a demo for you with. So, let me know in chat if you're still around. If not, I will hit you up next time you're here. Oh, a map. On the map, on the map, on the map, on the map. All right, cool. All right, here, let's get this set up then. Uh, skill toy, skill toy. Show the wheel. All right, here we go. We're spinning the wheel. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Let's see, we got flower sticks. All right, we're gonna rock. I'm gonna rock some flower sticks for you. There you go. Goodbye. All right, so we are going to turn that down. So, um, there we are. So, um, I am a skill toy aficionado. I actually got my start on the internet doing skill toys. So um, I, I was uh, sponsored by a toy called Astro Jacks for about 10 years. And um, so pretty much what I do uh, for follows and other random, I mean, every once in a while I do a full skill toy stream. Yeah, actually all my toys are over there. But um, today we are gonna be doing flower sticks. Um, pretty common during the medieval age. You almost always see these at those weirdo Renaissance fairs. So what we're going to do is we are going to hit up some music and make sure I got something good going, and uh, I will do a quick show for you. All right, let's get this set up here. Not bad. Nope. Uh, yes. Um, flower sticks. Um, the reason why they're called flower sticks is because of this little pom-pom right here. So it kind of looks like a little flower. Um, there's a bunch of other variants of it. Uh, devil sticks, luna sticks. Um, there, there's a lot of different styles of this, um, but typically they're called, uh, they're called flower sticks. Um, actually more often they're called devil sticks, but, um, but yeah, there's a lot of different types. Let's see here. There you go. <laughs> <Luna tics too. laughs> Pretty much. All right, here we go.
That's it. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You can see I've practiced a bit. I've owned, um, I've owned this set. How long have I owned this set? I've owned this set since 2005. So I've had these for over 12 years. I can't believe I've been playing these things for over 12 years. Holy crap. <laughs> All right. So, yep. That's uh that's one of the things. So let me so let me show you the wheel real quick. So these are all of the uh these are all the different toys that I do. Um the ones that I'm best at is the Yo-Yo 1A. That is a single yo-yo doing string tricks. Um also Astro Jacks and Diabolo. Um most everything else is stuff that I like to do. Um there are toys that I have. I'm not necessarily like psycho good with everything. I can do the basics and make it look pretty easy. But other than that, I just love doing all this stuff for fun. Well, anyway, Cass, thank you so much for mashing that follow button. I hope you enjoyed yourself tonight. Uh, you are free to go enjoy the rest of your evening, day, afternoon, wherever on earth you may be living on this fantastical earth. And uh, you are always welcome in this here, the Frito Bendito Taqueria. And uh, thank you for sticking around. Really appreciate it. Really appreciate it. Mucho. Drift. Just that one guy? Really? Really? Just that one little dude, mate? I knew that was right. Seriously, who throws a shoe? Who throws a shoe? That really hurts. That was my really bad Austin awesome Powers. Oh crap! Game cam's off. Oh darn it. <laughs> Sorry, man. It's been a while. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I've been I've been streaming for about two years. Um, it is an absolute hobby for me. Um, I am actually a civil engineer by trade, and um, I do a side hustle of uh, uh, coaching, private coaching, uh, competitive swimming. Um, so I, I just do this just for kicks. <laughs> and the uh, the whole skill toy thing is definitely just a hobby. Get up there, Tubbo. Get up there, Tubbo. Hey, hey, don't you dare throw your weight at me, boy. I will smizack you all over the place. Take that. I think one of the reasons why I actually like streaming is because I typically, you know, when I when I speak and stuff, when I'm streaming, it's actually my inner thoughts coming out anyway. Just due to my trade. <laughs> All right, man. Thanks, Cass. Thank you for stopping by, amigo. No, but um, I actually uh, a lot of the stuff that I say on stream is stuff I have going on in my head anyway. It's just when I have a mic on me and I'm actually playing for an audience. Um, I actually feel uh, not here a too. little less crazy, as I say. <gasps> I've met you before. I'll take care of them. You wait right here. <sighs> Please, may I go with you? I so want to get to the ball. I so want to get um. to the ball. To the ball. All right. But stay behind me. Or you'll get hurt. <laughs> yeah, I'm... You're not worried? Kind of drunk with rage. Didn't you tell me it was important to stay strong? Oh. No. Uh, no. Yeah, I guess I did. Oh, <laughs> I'm not used to talking to women. So, you ready? Yes. Uh, I'm not used to talking to women. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, beefy boy. Are you ready for this fantastic party? Take me there, meat. Protect Rinderella. Drift. So long. Don't walk into the enemy. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. Huh. 
I hope I don't hit her with friendly fire. Freeze. So long. It's like, oh darn it, just bum rush it all the way down the hall. Damage doesn't go down? Why doesn't her damage go down? What the heck? Take that! Drift! Want some? Oh, you oh, that's all I had to do? What the heck? Freeze! Oh, please help! Things are not looking good for Rindersella. Say goodbye! Ah, oh, crap. Drift! Make it stop! So long! Girl, girl, where are you running? Oh, girl, girl, girl. Girl. We shall do that. Oh, my camera. I'm not used to doing my skill toy camera that much anymore. Mm. <laughs> oh no, this is one of the scenes. Oh, this is thank one of the scenes. You, um, Tara. Thank you, Tara. It's a dude's name. <laughs> and I'm really a dude that's kind of wearing dress pants. Like, pants that are dresses. Ooh, hey, man meat. Oh, how cute. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, it's about time the music starts. This is the most epic dancing I have ever seen in my entire life. Maybe just believing is enough. Mm. But who is she, Mother? Do we know her? I don't well, know. Well, certainly seems to. I've never seen her before. <laughs> Nor I. But she certainly is. Hmm. Wait. There is something familiar about her. And maybe the fact that there are no other people that live in this universe, apparently. <laughs> Uh-oh. Unversed. <laughs> Tell me, how do I get up there? Um, well, uh, there is a passage beneath the foyer staircase. Is Thanks. There? <laughs> oh. 
La, 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 la. All right. Oh, how cute. They be all waltzing. They're waltzing. I know I don't waltz. I'm actually a good waltzer. I really enjoy I really enjoy me some ballroom dance. And that's no joke. I do know how to ballroom dance. I know how to ballroom dance cool. I know the... Quick step. And, uh, tango. I know tango pretty good. But my favorite by far is the Viennese waltz. That's the one where you just kind of like dance around and just twirl, 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 twirl towards freedom. It's fantastic. I love it. Okay, there were all these enemies before. Now this place is like stupid barren. Dude, just open the chest, bro. Bro. Come on, bro. Oh yeah, wait. There was something I wanted to check. Um, isn't like a sticker book or something? Ah, sticker album. No. No. There you go. Arrange the stickers. Ooh, a balloon. Oh my gosh, we blew this thing out of the way. Ooh, a pulsing crystal. I don't know what that does. Is that it? That's it. <laughs> So I get... Okay, so the more... more stickers I collect, the more I get stuffs. The more stuffs I get, the cooler things happen. Okay. Alright, let's melt some commands together. Let's see, can I go... that um, I think uh, 358 had a similar I know um, 358 had kind of a similar um, mechanic to it Freeze. so long drift yeah. alright let's see here let's actually uh, edit this up a little bit
moving on. Take that! Thunder, thunder. All right, we're throwing that one on. Throw that thunder on there. Slap it, it do. So yeah, um, but overall, Tales of Berseria is actually a really good game. I really thoroughly enjoyed Tales of Berseria. Just only work on. Actually, no. You know what? That one's almost got to level up. All right, we are going to go on with this. Let's see what happens now. <gasps> Hello, Maestro. Get out of my head! Nani? Down here! Guards? Guards? Oh, where could they possibly be? Where could possibly be? anybody be? I'll take care of this. There is nobody here!
Increase. That's always a good thing. Can't go wrong with those two, don't you know? Thank you. You saved us all. <sighs> you saved us all because we the all kind of The guests were just everything. starting to enjoy themselves. Oh, are they? Are well, they? Don't give up just yet. All the guests that aren't here. Oh, oh how cute! They're exchanging vows. Tell me something. Right over there. Have you always had a problem around here with those monsters? No, I believe uh, they began to appear shortly oh, after a boy God. in a mask arrived in our kingdom. Those that saw him said the monsters obeyed his every command. A boy in a mask? A boy in a mask. Do you know where he is now? Well, um, no. I don't believe anyone has seen him since then. I see. Do you? Oh, my goodness. It's midnight. Yes, so it is. But why? Goodbye. Wait, come back. Please come back. I'm sorry. Oh, my apologies. Yikes. That was not magnificent at all. Oh. <laughs> Render Sala! Mademoiselle! Senorita! Senorita. Wait! Wait. <laughs> it's so much better in the movie because he goes like, Senorita! Mademoiselle! Hmm? Senorita! Oh, Papa. hi! Hello! Tara! Tara, Ven ran away from home. What? No crap, Sherlock. I think he left to go find you. Oh. Do you have any idea why? No. <gasps> Actually, just before I left, he tried to tell me something. I should have listened to what he had to say. Oh. But you're a her you're a terrible pseudo older brother. So, did you manage to locate Master Zaynort? No, but it seems he's looking for pure hearts filled with light. Pure hearts filled with light. All I can tell you is that his search hasn't taken him here. All right. All I'll right. stay and see if I can find more clues. Okie dokie. Okay. The prince is in the ballroom ahead. He might have some answers. Thanks. Aqua. You still have the same dream? Well, yes. There's this girl here. Her name is Cinderella. She made me realize how powerful it is just to believe. Oh. No matter how impossible things seem, a powerful enough dream will always be enough to light the darkness. Mm. If you see her, give her my thanks. Will do. The boy in the mask who is leading the unversed. Who is he? Who am I? Does he have anything to do with Master Xehanort's disappearance? All right. All right, we've gotten two. Wow, we've gone through two areas tonight. Maybe we can make it three. All right, that's number two. Man, these areas are a lot shorter than Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> Key 
blade. Oh, it has more criticals. So we're knocking one down. Yeah, we're gonna do that. Combat three, combat one. Oh, let's land a departure. Yeah, let's, let's, let's land here. All right, let's see if there's anything actually here. Yeah, because I think after, um, since I finished up um, Tales of Berseria, I think offline I'm actually going to move on and um, do the uh, single player campaign for uh, Call of Duty Black Ops, which is actually or Black Ops 3, actually. Uh, it was a uh, free game and, uh, because of my PS Plus membership. Um, this will actually be the first Black Ops game I have ever played. <laughs> Well, I can't say it's my first Call of Duty. Um, I played uh, one of those World War II... Uh, I think it was the World War II Call of Duty on the, uh, on the Wii. Um, I played it at a buddy's house back in college. Um, not necessarily what one would call... Question mark? <laughs> Yeah, it was. Uh, it left. It left a lot to be desired from a first-person shooter. Um, but we had fun doing it. We just played two-player and just mocked it relentlessly. So it was good fun. But I still can't believe we actually bought that game. Um, but yeah, this will be the actual first uh, Black Ops. Call of Duty Black Ops game. Alright, so I picked up. I think I picked up everything here. Alright, we'll call that good and get out of here. Alright, so I picked up a couple items. That'll work for me. So I think I'll play that because I should be able to beat that within a couple of. about a week or so of just playing. Wow, we already got 100% of the treasures. Look at me go. <laughs> Yeah, so I'll probably do that, and then um, I think I'll do a change of pace and w play, um, what is that? Um, I'll play some, uh, Spirit of the Mirror. Crap, I can't remember what name that Come is. from the farthest space. Deus Ex. Through wind and darkness, uh, I summon thee. Speak! Show me and the face. Are you what wouldst thou know, my queen? Magic mirror on the wall. Who is the fairest one of all? Me! Oh. Famed is thy beauty, majesty. But hold, a lovely maid I see. Alas, she is more fair than thee. Alas for her. Reveal her name. Alas for her, me Lips red as the rose. Hair black as ebony, skin white as snow. Snow white? Oh, dear she. A mirror that knows and sees everything. How about that? Huh. The heart of Snow White doth shine bright. Beware, my queen, a heart of light. Another one? <gasps> oh. Wait. What if Master Xehanort is here? <gasps> Who goes there? Guinness. My name is Terra. I'm looking for a man named Xehanort. Master Xehanort. I thought maybe you might have seen him. That name is of no consequence to me. Is it? Wait. 
I have a task for you. If you succeed, I will ask the mirror where you might find this master Zero. Well, why can't I just do it and now? And the mirror will know? Do you dare to question me? What is the task? <laughs> there is a young maid who resides in this castle. Her name is Snow White. Kill her. And to make sure you do not fail, bring back her heart. Yay, in this. I get to be the huntsman. Yay! Her heart. Mm. I don't understand. Of course you don't, beefy boy. You're after the hearts of light too? What I demand we is are her one life. And the same I've had more than more. enough of her light. What did this maiden do to you? That is no concern of yours. Now, heed my words. My radiance is all the light this kingdom needs. Where can I find her? Outside the castle. There is a glade of wildflowers. I hate them. They make you me are dismissed. Sick. Go now and seek her there. A heart of light. This Snow White is my best chance right now. Maybe she will lead me closer to Master Xehanort. Yay! Let's kill her! Woohoo! But what if I... <gasps> what if no. I do something evil again? I that happen. Well, you've already offered to kill her. What's taking her heart, huh? I mean, come on! Sorry, I'm in what I like to refer to as the sticky booger face. It's where all of the uh, schnot and fun stuff in my brain is all like congealing after I'm sick. So uh, it like comes out in blobs and it sticks in the back of my nasal passages. And then I have to make some annoying noises in order to get it out. So whenever I mute the mic, I am attempting to get really nasty stuff out of my nasal passages. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I can smash pots! Yay! Take that! Take that! Hands have leveled up.
trying to cover on me, basically. Thunder! So long! We're gonna check out these command decks. We're gonna look at this melding stuff. All right, so if I do um, Blizzard and I do... rock here and there. I guess we'll have to go with this. Let's see here. Oh, there you are, Batty. Got some we got some upgraded um, tech. We're gonna start Take that! Heal! 
Thunder! How you take that? Well, that worked. All right, so we are running around here. We are trying to figure out what exactly is going here. Oh, that did, that did a thing. And of course. There are very, very few instances where I can um, be like, oh, hey, I can actually like be active in chat and sit and watch a stream. I usually always just listen to it via audio. So there is no problem with me doing the Wait, was I supposed to do something up there? There ain't been nothing there. Safe as in no, no, uh, no enemy. Or at least in theory, it should be. Alright. Get up! Alright, we're gonna go back to this shop. We're actually gonna buy some new commands. Uh, that's not the shop. But we're just gonna save anyway. So now let's go edit deck, commands, we're going to take out bind, we're going to throw in magnet, and then we're going to take out, uh, what do we want to take out, let's take that out, throw in fire, and then command list, oh, did I just discard I just totally discarded something that I had equipped. What the heck did I... I got rid of my cure. fan flibbantastic. I got rid of my cure. Mm. Mm. Uh, lame.
Okay, so Leaf Bracer does that when I can do Cure Command. Okay, so let's shop. Okay, so let's sell a couple things. anything either. That's fantastic. Look at that. I am such a smarty. Alright, so let's go back to the command dags and replace what I stupidly threw away. Um, let's throw on um, another quick blitz. Actually going to go back and we're going to reload and I'm going to cheat. <laughs> yeah, I got rid. Of, I got rid of my dang cure. How dare I? How dare I just? Oh, here's a cure. <laughs> that was below average. All right, we're gonna we're we're gonna finish off this area because I have a feeling that we are actually pretty close to finishing this area. We're going to do this thing again. We're not going to buy so many quick blitz. And, uh, yeah. Yeah. That. We're not going to do dumb things. <laughs> uh... And by the way, hello, Shizui. Hello. It shows that you're new here. Welcome to the Frito Bandito Taqueria, my friend. I hope you see look there's my cure back safe and sound where it should be in my command deck All right, we're gonna do this again I'm gonna buy a fire buy a magnet and we're gonna buy an arrow there you go now okay we're gonna get rid of bind and we're gonna throw on magnet and then we're to put on take out sliding dash and we're going to throw on poison because I can alright there we go alright there we go now I'm not down So, um, just a quick programming note. Tomorrow night, I will be uh, streaming on LDS Gamers. Um, this will be a uh, not normal stream night for me. Um, I typically stream Tuesdays, Thursdays, Fridays, and Saturdays. Um, just because it, I, it's not a good idea for me to stream every single evening. But um, this week, I'm making an exception for LDS Gamers. Um, they are doing a new kind of programming for their channel and um i am a member of the fantastic lds streaming lds gaming community and uh which right there that's my brand new yeah that's really quiet i'm gonna need to fix this um like i said i have been constantly messing around with um my volumes and all that stuff, so I haven't necessarily um, gotten everything all nailed down yet. I'm working on it. I'm pretty close. I swear. I wonder if that's her. She has to be. Uh, she's got a little bird flitting around her. Hello. Aren't you startled? <laughs> I'm here to kill you. Aren't you startled? <laughs> Should I be? <laughs> it's true, then. Her heart is pure light. She's the one. Uh, because she's not freaked is out by your matter? beefcake this? Does the name Xehanort mean anything to you? Why, why 
I know. For a potato I don't salad. think I've ever heard that name. Now what? Uh, kill her. Wait, I'm first. <laughs> hey, wait! Don't go in there alone. <sighs> Out of my way. Ah, oh, darn you. Darn you. Alright, let go. Let go, Dinkuses. At least I don't have some sort of. Thunder! Take that! Shabooey. <laughs> oh my gosh, that is so OP. <laughs> and it just got struck. Fantastic. <laughs> oh, that Magnet time! Want some? Ow! Stop! Freeze! So long! Okay! Which reminds me, I do need to bust out Street Fighter 2. <gasps> Ooh, air slide. Yay! That's fantastic. Run into the forest, beefy boy. She said she doesn't know anything about Master Xehanort. Or anything in general. That leaves me with just one other option. Kill her. The mirror. Back at the castle. Um, you were supposed to kill her. You were supposed to steal her heart. Her still beating heart. Was that too sinister? I mean, come on. Oh, chest. Kaboom. Hungry, hungry crystal. Chests. See, the nice thing about this game is that the the uh, it, the single areas aren't too big, so it's actually pretty easy to make sure that you're getting all of the uh, items within a particular area. All right, let's see here. Do I have any? See, my philosophy when I play games is um, flip out of my way, boy. Boy, I will counter your butt all the way back to last Tuesday, boy. Boy. Um, my general philosophy in playing these games is I like to, uh, I like to grind, but I don't like to just sit and grind. You know, like, I like to, I like to actively grind. So, when you see me play games like this, I will actively murder everything. Which is actually kind of funny and uh, gets me in trouble when I play Zelda type games. I like to murder everything. And in Zelda games, I don't have to murder everything. <laughs> oh. Out of my way, boy. Yes. Pretty much. Yeah, just because um, I typically don't have time to just sit and grind anymore like I used to back in the day. 
Um, the most I will ever grind in a game. Hey, Doctor Jack! What up, my buddy? What up, dude? Thank you, my friend, for that fantastic follow. If you are not following the fantastically fantastic Mr. Dr. Tech with that fancy little purple check mark right by his name, you should. He plays a lot of games that I will never touch. <laughs> he likes him the Overwatch. He likes him the Furtner. He likes him the MOBA. He played some MOBA tonight. No, 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 ow. Who dat? Hi, I'm Tara. I'm Beefy Boy. Look at me. I got like gigantic pecs and balloon pants that the Pharaoh wants so bad. Um, his pants are actually technically called Banyan pants, by the way. I actually know the name of them. <laughs> they are uh, very common with uh, boy spinners and other um, people that like hedonistic rituals. I mean, wait, <laughs> So, um, how was Battle Right? I saw that you were playing Battle Right tonight. Um, that's the, um, if I am not mistaken, that is that new, uh, MOBA that just came out on the screen, right? Yeah, 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 that's, that's the one that came out on the Switch. I've tried, I've tried those MOBA things before. Oh, it's been out a couple years. Ah, it's got a Battle Royale. Okay, got it. Yeah, because I know I've heard of Battle Right, but I think, if I remember correctly, I think it just came out on the Switch. I could be wrong, but I think it did. All right, back to the castle. Hello, Queenie. How dare you return here, you blundering fool. What are you talking about? <laughs> I ordered you to bring me Snow White's heart. A request I chose to ignore. Ah. You know, you claim to be radiant. Yes, I can not believe you I have never played a single Kingdom Hearts, and thank you so much for the hundred biddies, my friend. You will pay for such insolence. Yeah, I'm actually Magic starting my uh, full series wall. playthrough. Consume this fool once and for all. Nice. <laughs> Bring it, Mirror Boy. <laughs> but what? What? Are you sleeping, Alas, boy? My liege, that I cannot do. I have no power save answers true. Oh! Huh? You dare defy your queen? <laughs> Don't take me, bro. Uh oh. That can't be good. What? Uh -oh. That can't be good. Who that? Who that there? No, but I'm doing a full series playthrough and I'm actually starting with Birth by Sleep. This is the only game in the Kingdom Hearts series that I have actually not played yet. So this is actually a uh, blind playthrough for me. So this is the boss of uh, Snow White's area right here. Apparently it is the mirror. All right, come on, be good boy. What the? What the? Which one do I hit? Yes, I am going by chronological order. I don't know which one I'm supposed to hit. I should have probably done that. Come on, boy. Come on, boy. Uh, 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 uh. Not it. Where's the where's the smiley one? Smiley boy, eat it. Ooh, gold rush. Thunder. 
Come on, boy. Where are you? Where are you? You're done. Oh. Increase the volume of those commands. <laughs> that didn't work as well as I wanted it to. <gasps> How did you escape? Because I'm awesome. Now you will ask the mirror where can I find Master Xehanort? Magic mirror, instruct this knave. Give him the answers he doth crave. Wow, that was Beyond a good Beyond both run. light and dark he dwells, where war was waged upon the fells. And that helps me out how? Is that all? Thanks. You've been a big help. Oh, yeah, and Shizui, don't feel bad about not knowing this game. <laughs> yeah, this is... Um, I never owned a PSP. Um, I borrowed one from a buddy, and I played um, Final Fantasy... Uh, what was that one? The one was Zack. Crisis Core. That's it. Master Ericus said he first received word of these events from Master Yen Sid. That is the only game I've ever played on the PSP. Maybe it's time I went and spoke with him myself. <laughs> Crisis Core was pretty good. Poor reach, balance boost, blah blah blah. Slap things, slap things around with magic, and you're good to go. Cutscene. So those of you from Dr. Techstream, thank you all so much for sticking around. My name is the Pharaoh. This here is the Frito Bandito Taqueria. Um, just to let you know, I will be streaming on LDS Gamers tomorrow. Um, LDS Gamers. Um, let me throw that up there. Um, if you give them, if you check them out, um, LDS Gamers on Twitch, um, I will be on their channel tomorrow night streaming a game from the brand new, uh, overwhelmingly positive Humble Bundle. Um, and on that note... Um, now that this is done, we are actually going to... Let's throw this save here. So, um, so for those of you that are, like I said, my name is The Pharaoh. I love playing JRPGs. Currently in the stream mix, I have this game and Project Octopath Traveler, which I play on the weekends. I'm so used to calling it Project Octopath. It should just be Octopath Traveler. Um, I play that on Friday and Saturdays. I play this game on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Um, so we are going to be shutting down the taqueria for the night. And I'm going to leave you with my fancy little ending. Because Radical Dreamers is just so dang good. It's such a good song. Um, I, in uh, college, I actually used to um, go to sleep with this song all the time. You know what? We're going to boost this thing. Where's my dang stream deck? Stream deck, where are you? There you are. We're going to boost this up a little bit. Let's see here. There we go. Listen to that goodness. Mm. This song is so good. All right. So uh, thank you all so much for tuning in. And yes, I know. I am a massive Chrono Trigger fan. And that why is that kitty there? The kitty...
Um, yes, I am a massive Chrono Trigger fan. Um, massive Chrono Trigger fan is kind of an understatement. Um, I pretty much know freaking everything about that game. I might as well be a speedrunner on that game, but I don't know all the... I would be a um, New Game Plus glitchless speedrunner. That's what I would be, just because I know the whole game, but I don't know all the weird glitches and whatnot. Anyway, um, so thank you all so much for coming by. Um, I had a lot of fun tonight actually being able to sit and play this game. The past week or so, um, I've been fighting off a head cold, and I finally got over it today. So I'm really glad that I'm finally fully back in action, ready to uh, play this game, just because the past couple of streams have been... So anyway, um, so I'm done for tonight. I will be back tomorrow night on LDS Gamers. Um, I will be hosting it here on the um, on the channel. Oh, Chizui, I'm, th I'm glad that you were able to come by. I know this is your first time, and thank you so much for dropping by. I'm always glad when people visit this year, El Frito Bandito Taqueria. Um, for those of you that don't know, Taqueria means a taco shop in Spanish because tacos are fantastic, and I like tacos, and I like sharing tacos. Frito Bandito, he's over in the back. He uh, makes the best virtual tacos. Mm. His tacos al pastor, his taco de lengua, taco de coco. Mm. Well, it's actually coconut tacos. That sounds disgusting. Anyway. <laughs> Sometimes I just go in Spanish mode and just start throwing things around, even if it makes sense or not. Um, so, uh, so like I said, I'll be back tomorrow night um, on LDS Gamers and um, be playing a brand new game. Um, it is um, Ma, Ma, Ma something. What the, what's the great game? Let me see. It's um, Mamadora. Mamadora from the brand new um, Humble Bundle. We'll be playing that tomorrow night in LDS Gamers. Uh, starting around 8.30, 9 o'clock, somewhere in that region. Uh, my start time is always variable. Um, that is because um, I am a father. I am a member of Twitch Team Mad, by the way. If you want to check out some other great mom and dad streamers, that's a great place to look. Um, if you want to join the Discord, I just threw it up in chat right now. Um, you can come to the Frito Bandito Taqueria's after party, uh, which goes on all day every day all times of the day you are more than welcome to participate in the shenanery that we got going on there um i like to post random stuff for my days my travels and everything that i do and pretty much me and my uh, brother-in-law just kind of have fun in there um so you are more than welcome to join the discord not only you are more than welcome i kind of highly recommend it because that is where i post everything related to this here the taqueria um my Twitter handle, where's my Twitter? There's my Twitter. Um, I kind of post random stuff. I get a little bit political on that. I consider myself a constitutional libertarian. So um, if you kind of like to dabble in politics a little bit, want to hear my takes, um, you probably want to check my Twitter for that. I try and keep that off his here, Twitch, just because I know Twitch and most other social media platforms are kind of a dumpster fire when it comes to politics. And I kind of like to keep those off there. But anyway... So uh, that is the end of the song, and I've probably blathered on for quite a bit. You know what we're going to do tonight? Since we have a bunch of fantastic people here, we are going to find someone to raid. Um, we are going to rock, um, and we're going to check out the LDS Gamers stream team. No, you be quiet. I don't want to see you. Let's see here. Let's check and see if there's any other fantastic LDS Gamers that are on here. We now have a fantastic stream team. Um, looks like, uh, oh, looks like LDS is actually, um, uh, Martin Luther Bling is still on LDS Gamers. So we are going to punt you all over there. We're gonna, here is the raid command. If you wouldn't mind copy posting that, we will go raid LDS Gamers. All right. So we got our raid set up. We are all ready to go. We are going to raid those fantastic people over at LDS Gamers. And let's see here. Let's go to the channel itself. And that is it for me, guys. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Once again, my name is The Feral. This year is the Frito Bandito Tagaria. I hope to see you tomorrow night on LDS Gamers. If not, I hope to see you on Thursday. I am going to cut off so we can get this... Um, we can get this uh, countdown started.
I think. I don't really know how this works. <laughs> I'm not good with raids. Anyway, I'm out.